Amazon has announced a browser-based toolkit called Sumiri and that the company hopes will make virtual reality and augmented reality development accessible to people without advanced coding or 3D rendering skills. Currently in preview, Sumerian allows the creation of VR and R scenes that target platforms like the HTC Vive, Oculus Rift, and Google Daydream, and it works with several other Amazon products. Built on Amazon Web Services, the toolkit is intended to help with building experiences like training simulations, virtual concierge services, enhanced online shopping experiences, and virtual house or land tours. Of course, it can be used to make games, too. In any case, users of the toolkit can create animated characters that interact with the player or customer verbally. That's thanks to Amazon's existing speech recognition and natural language processing tech, Dex and Poly, respectively. These images from Amazon's blog post announcing the toolkit show some of the basics as with similar applications, you start by selecting a creating a scene. The scene view resembles powerful 3D rendering and game development applications, but it is relatively simple and streamlined. You can select from prior existing assets from Amazon or import your own in FBX and OBJ files. Naturally, you can drag and drop assets directly into the scene. Work being done on a more complete scene. Amazon is joining a chorus of platforms and companies investing in our development. Apart from Microsoft's Windows Mixed Reality platform, you also have Arcit, Arcor, and various game development platforms and engines. Sumerian supports Apple's Arcit, which is an augmented reality platform for iOS devices. Support for Google's Arcor platform is coming, but not yet available. The same goes for Unity, a popular cross-platform game development platform. However, Unity Labs EVP Silvio Druin told us last year that the Unity Labs team has focused heavily on making its own way for creatives to build VR worlds without advanced technical knowledge. You could be entirely in VR without ever touching the editor, without ever setting any texture, shader, or global illumination parameters, and you would start to be able to assemble a game, he said. Meanwhile, Apple CEO Tim Cook has said he believes R will be as significant in the industry as the introduction of Apple's own App Store. Like Unity's initiatives, Sumerian involves dragging and dropping assets, and it offers a visual scripting option. That said, it is built on the WebGL JavaScript and WEBVR JavaScript APIS, and it offers a JavaScript editor and scripting library. Sumerian is free to use, but it's built on AWS which means you need an existing AWS account and you'll be charged for services related to that platform if you use more than is allotted to a free account. You can request access to the preview with your AWS account number, but be warned access is invite only. So it's not certain you'll gain access right away.